Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and thanks for watching. Today's video is going to be a collaboration with Dinah. Dinah is doing a makeup look from Shania Twain's video that don't impress me much. And I am doing Jennifer Lopez Ain't It Funny, the remix. I absolutely love this look. I love that video. She also has a purple eye look, which I was thinking about doing, but I decided to go with this one since I just recently did a purple eye look on my channel. So I decided just to go with this one. I absolutely love it. I hope you guys do too. Don't forget to check out Dinah's video when you're done with mine. She is amazing and so is her channel. So go and check her out and show her some love. You guys are gonna love her. And now if you wanna see how I created my look, then just continue watching. Thanks guys. So first I'm going to prime my eyes with my MAC Pro Low Wear Concealer. Then I'll be going in with Naked Basics. And with Naked 2, I will be applying this shadow all over my crease with a blending brush by BH Cosmetics. Then I'll be going in with my Naked One and I'll be using the color Buck. I'm going to apply this on top of Naked Two just to really define my crease from inner corner to outer corner. Jennifer definitely has a very defined crease in this look. So this is what I am doing. Then all over my lid, I'll be using Walk of Shame but I am also going to apply this on the inner corners of my eyes. Her shadow is all over the lid, all the way to the inner corners of her eyes. And I am also going to highlight my brow bone. Then with some gel eyeliner, I'll be doing a small wing because she does have a wing eye look. It's just a very small one, so that's what I'll be doing. After that, I am going in with my Ardell Glamour Wispy Lashes, but first I'm going to prep them with some mascara. Now for my face, I am going to prime with the Smashbox Minimizing Primer, and then for foundation, I'll be mixing these two, which is CoverGirl 3-in-1 Outlast and the L'Oreal Dream Lumi. I'm going to buff everything in with my Sigma Angle Kabuki F84 brush. I love this brush for foundation. I like it more than my flat Kabuki brush. If anyone's interested, I have a coupon down below. Then, to conceal under my eyes and hide those dark circles, I will be using my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. And then with the Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer, I'll be highlighting. After that, I'll blend everything in with a damp beauty blender. With my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit, I'll be mixing these two shades to set the concealer. To bronze my face a bit, I will be using my NYC Sunny Bronzer and I'm going to apply this all in the areas that I usually contour and I'm going to also contour my nose. Going back with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit, I'll be using this shade to contour. On this look, she has a very soft peach blush with a golden highlight. So I'm first going to go in with my Makeup Academy Cream Blush. Then to highlight, I'll be using my Mary Lou by The Balm. And on top of that cream blush, I'll be adding Luminoso by Milani. Going back with the buck, I'm going to apply this on my lower lash line. 
Jennifer is wearing fake lashes on her bottom lashes so I am going to apply these by Red Cherry. I'm going to cut them in two and then I'm going to apply them gently. After that, I'm just going to add some mascara. On her waterline, she has a nude liner so I'm going in with this Remel liner in nude. For her lips, she has a peachy lip gloss but I'll be mixing these two to give me that look. The lipstick is by Remel New Delight and the lip gloss is by Maybelline in Illusion. After that, this JLo look is complete. I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to check out Dinah's video. The link is down below in the description box. Thank you all so much for watching and I will talk to you guys on my next video.